Hello, I'm Jo Loring Fisher and I am the author and illustrator of Just Like You, which is published by Otter Barry Books. I thank you so much for coming along today. Um, I'm going to do a short reading from Just Like You and then I'm going to do a little bit of a draw along for you. So if you want to, you can join in. Um, if not, you can just watch it and I hope you enjoy it. Now, Just Like You is about a little girl here with her bunny rabbit who's on a very, very long journey but she's got quite a lot in common with you and quite a lot in common with me. So I hope you enjoy it. Just like you. I've got two eyes. I've got two ears. I've got one mouth and one nose. I've got two hands two feet, two knees, and one bottom. My feet can take me a long, long way. And they can help me run fast too. And that's it for now. So I'm gonna do a drawing for you. And the drawing that I've chosen is the one right at the beginning. I've got two eyes. So I hope you enjoy that. There we are. So I'm gonna start by doing her head. Lots of hair. Oops. Lots of hair here. And there we are. She's got quite curly hair. Now she's got two big, smiley, beautiful eyes. There we are. Two little cheery eyebrows. I'm going to colour her eyes in, like that, that's one. That's two. Now next we'll do her nose. And then she's got a very sweet little smile, like that. Now next we need to do her fingers, so they're pointing up to her eyes. So we've got a finger and then her other little fingers, one, two, three, that are bent over. And her arm comes here and then I'm going to do a little bit of her thumb there. You just see the top of her thumb. There we go like that. I'm going to put a little bit of her body here. Now in the book she's wearing a little red t-shirt, not red, sorry, blue t-shirt. So I'll pop that in in a second. Oh dear, I've drawn over that line where her She's pointing into her eye on that side. Never mind. If you're doing it, you can rub it out. So I expect you'll be doing it with a pencil. So you can just rub that line out if you if you followed that. <coughs> like that. Now, another thing that she's got on her t-shirt is a feather. And I don't know if you have noticed at all in the book, but there are lots of swallows. And a bit like this little girl here, they go on very, very long journeys. They migrate from one country to another country, a bit like our little girl here has had to do. I'll give her a bit of a t-shirt there, top of that there. Now, I'll give her a bit more curly hair, I think. Like that. Make her eyes a bit bigger. There we go. 
Now, very, very roughly, now you can do it nicely if you want. You could do it with pencils, or you could do it with paint, or you could do it with collage, so cutting out little bits of, of, bits of um, paper or other textures. But I'm just gonna do it very quickly like this now with felt tips, and you can do it with felt tips too if you want. So I'm just gonna give her some little rosy cheeks. Probably a bit bright really on this pen, but never mind. You get the picture. There we are, like that. And I'm gonna give her a little bit of blue on her t-shirt, just like she is here. Maybe actually I need to draw her bunny in as well. Shall I draw her bunny? I'll do that in a minute. We'll do that in a minute. Okay, so let's do a little bit of blue on her t-shirt. Now I'm only doing this really, really messily because I'm doing it quite quickly. But you can do it really nicely if you want to. Uh, very quickly. <clears throat> Lots of scribbles. Scribbly, scribbly, scribbly. By the way, I hope you like my drawing board here. It's very nice, isn't it? Anyone would think it was in fact a fridge, but it's not really. It's a magic drawing board that just so happens to be in my kitchen. There we are. So she's got her t-shirt now. Now, another thing I wanted to draw in were some trees. <clears throat> so I think I'll do that with the black one. There we are. Just a little hint of trees up here. That's the bases. And then another one. Whoop. There we go. A bit like the trees that are in the story in the book. There we are. It's quite good fun doing trees, I think. You can just do all these different interesting shapes. Can I do another one there? There we are. Now, another thing that I really wanted to do is one of those little swallows. So I'm going to do that here. Give her a little hair. Now they have quite interesting shape, quite pointy sort of wings. And it goes up that there. There is beautiful pointy tails. Like that. And a teeny tiny beak and an eye. And what I'm going to do, I'm not going to colour all the birds in, but I'm going to colour in his little red chest. Because under his chin and on his uh, chest it's a little bit red. So we'll just do that. And now I'm going to add the bunny rabbit. It's a very cute bunny rabbit. I think we'll have him here. One little ear like that. One little ear like that. And he's got his little eye there. Little eyelash. And a little eye there. And an eyelash. And then he's going to have just a nose. And maybe a little paw coming up too. Like that. I'll give him some rosy cheeks because his cheeks are slightly rosy in the uh, in the book um, here too. There we are, it's the bunny. I hope you enjoyed your just like you reading and draw along. Thank you so much for coming along. Bye.